For Women's History Month, I wanted to visit a statue honoring the first woman ever. But I was shocked with what I saw. Really flat. No tits, no ass. Who's honoring a woman with no tits and no ass? The great thing about being a woman is everyone wants to fuck you. So if she's not looking at, you know, with a tit and an ass, then who's gonna want to fuck her? It's not right and I need to do something about it because they have done her dirty. So I set out to rectify a moral failing. The notorious RBG needed a voluptuous SOS. Give R B G A B B L. I'm actually reluctant to identify as a feminist due to, you know, people who say that can be rant, like weird and awkward. But if this is what feminism is about, you know, helping women look their best. Hey, call me a damn feminist. Do you care about women's issues? Please sign to help her. Do you care about women's issues? What can I do to help? There's a statue of Ruth Bader Ginsburg yep. and uh, she looks like shit. I'm trying to get her a BBL. Okay. Would what, you what, sign? What is that? What a is Brazilian that? butt lift. She needs to be more voluptuous. Okay. RBG's got to have an ass in order for somebody to respect that? Yeah. Then you don't want to deal with those motherfuckers. Oh! I don't agree with him at all, but it's important to talk to people across the aisle. Do you care about women's issues? Yeah, but I'm busy with dogs. Uh, dogs before women. Do you guys care about women's issues? No? Okay, that's fine. I feel like no one cares about me. I gotta go, I'm tired, but I do care. Okay, do you think I should get a BBL? <laughs> of course these men wouldn't understand me, but was I resigned to RBG's fate too? Is anyone gonna remember me when I die? Does anyone care about me if I don't have a fat ass? I think that um, I need to have, I need to change my body to be loved. And then I found my knight in shining armor. I'm getting people to sign a petition to have her get a BBL. Oh yeah, okay. What is that? You go inside and look and just tell me if I'm being like sensitive. In here? It's not really my type, I guess. Why? Uh, you're, not, you're not gonna have tits and ass. Will you sign, please? But and it's because she doesn't have tits and ass. I'm gay, and I kind of have been wanting to dress like a guy, but I feel like maybe actually dressing like a guy is not feminist. Well, I, I mean, I don't know. You know? Would you fuck me? Um, seriously? Dude, would you fuck me? I, I, I don't, I mean, I... Uh, You're not gonna get I don't, No, I don't know, I don't know. I, I, probably not, probably not. It's mostly like personality stuff for me. No, come on. It's hard to, like... Maybe if you were wearing like a dress or something, like it'd be easier. A dress? It would be easier to what? Imagine fucking me? Alright, I'm gonna get a dress. Okay. And so, I was off to a world I wasn't that familiar with. I put up the signatures of the men who trusted me to get RBG a BBL. Then I caught a glimpse of the Rosie O'Donnell moniker I was sporting, and I knew then and there, no more gay shit. No more feigning masculinity. I'm a born-again woman. I called in my male friend who had been filming me all day. Oh! He'd never looked twice at me, oh, but once he saw my tits and ass, he knew he needed to fuck me in the Target dressing room. And don't worry, RBG, you're next.